Hey everybody, Logic Bomb 82 here from the Mature Minded Gamers Group. Today we're checking out Mystic Veil. Vale. It's a deck building card game. Uh, I think I read that there's a board game based off of it. Or, well, the game is based off the board game. But uh, I've never played it before, nor have I heard of it. But when I seen it on Keymailer, I was pretty interested because it sounded like my type of game. So I want to give a shout out to Keymailer and the developers for hooking me up with a key. Let's jump in and see what this game has to offer. Multiplayer coming soon, so obviously we're just going to do classic. Number of players. Yeah, we're going to play one player. We're going to make it easy since this is our first game. You must choose either pass or push. If you wish to push, press the push button. I'm going to call that that. This will move you immediately to the harvest phase. Okay. If you wish to push, press the card button. This will place your on-deck card into your field and draw a new card onto your deck. Determine if you have spoiled. If you have four more spoils revealed in your play area, your spoil, your spoil and must end your turn. Oh, okay, you spoil and must end your turn. What's up, puppy? Can you go side, buddy? All right, everybody, I'll be right back and let the dog out. All right, sorry about that. Oh. Okay. Uh, I got a feeling I'm gonna forget some of those rules. I'm gonna try hard not to though. to look at here. So we're in planting phase. Where are the buttons? There they are. This would place a card. I have a curse land. A curse land. An empty card. Another curse land. Okay. And this is my deck. Or if this is my hand. A little more explanation here, game. What's, what's happening here? Hmm. Alright, let's hit this button. Your harvest phase is when you count up your, looks like blue mana, and spirit symbols. Okay. Resolve harvest abilities on cards in your field. Score, looks like the TARDIS. Buy Val, uh, Val card, Val. Yeah, I guess it is Val, cards. And buy advancements up to two each. Once you have finished the harvest phase, click that button. Don't you? So. Okay, it looks like it's going to highlight the ones I can buy. This costs two. How much do I have? I have two. No animal symbols and two. So I could buy this card. <clears throat> so the question is, how do I buy it? Drag it down. Doesn't... Oh, I bet I put it in one of these empty slots. There we go. Okay. It has an ongoing. Cancel all but one. That's spoiled symbol on this card. I don't know what it means by on this card. I didn't get that part. But I spent my mana, so let's go ahead and advance. <coughs> Discard phase. Okay, planting phase is back again. So did my opponent not get a turn? I don't really understand that part of the game. I would think my opponent would get another turn by himself. Hmm. 
Well, let's uh, let's try to figure this out again. Okay, so I have back. I'm back to my two mana. I have some fertile soils. I can't buy this fertile soil. Looks like it may produce one down here. So this produced probably. I don't know. I'm a little confused. I think I want to buy one of these to cost four though. So we're gonna advance our turn and keep our two. Hopefully, uh, hopefully it, it carries over. We'll find out. Does not, it doesn't look like that sucks. Hmm. Well, this makes it a little harder. So it looks like I'm gonna have to buy these fertile soils, but not on this phase. Let's hit this button, see what it does. What did that do? Now I have seven mana somehow. Which I don't really understand. Hmm. Well, I can buy a good card at least. This is going to produce me these elements. Moon Wolf. Ooh. Got to like armor and stuff. Grasslands. I don't think I need to get this wellspring. So we're gonna go past the planting phase. Pick up the wellspring. I still have three more. I could technically buy another fertile land, which we're gonna do. Okay. Still don't know what I'm doing really, but we're slowly figuring things out. Okay. I don't understand this part. That took that card. Put it over here. Give me one more mana. I'm gonna buy the Moon Wolf. Oh, so now I have to replace a card. Oh no, I went on top of that card. Okay. Hmm. It's a dog barking again, I'll bring it back. All right, sorry about that, I am back. All right. So, strange, that card went on top of that card. Don't know what that means exactly. But harvest phase is over, it looks like. So we will advance on. Okay. So, we have two mana again. Planting Phase should take, I don't know where I thought would be that card. But maybe put it on top of one of these cards? Let's see what happens. No, it moves it over, okay. I just don't understand that whole phase. It doesn't make much sense. Did, was there a tutorial that I missed? Reset tutorial. I think I am in the tutorial, but let's reset it. Dad needs help. I don't understand this whole thing either. This must be the way they're moving down, I guess.
If you have played that, now I have 7 mana again. So I don't understand what's causing that. Now I can buy things again. Okay, let's read this again. Planting phase. You must choose to either pass or push. If you wish to pass, press the button, the forward button, and this will move you immediately to your harvest phase. If you wish to push, press the card button. This will place your on-deck card into your field and draw a new card onto your deck. Determine if you have spoiled. If you have four or more spoiled revealed in your play area, you spoil and must end your turn. You must not have spoiled. Go back to step one and repeat. If you have not spoiled, go back to step one and repeat. I mean, I guess I understand that now. So this is my play area on this side. This is my deck. What I don't understand is these cards. I guess I'm buying them. Pop looks cool. I have four mana, so I can buy them. Let's go ahead and grab them real quick. I think. Well, I'm not in that phase. Okay, so I think if I hit advanced. The harvest phase is when you count up your mana and spirit symbols. Resolve harvest abilities on your cards in your field. Score the... Um... Oh, the TARDIS, whatever you want to call it. Buy Val cards and buy advancements. Up to two of each. These must be advancements up here. No buy cost, though, so I don't quite understand that. I might have a B symbol and a plant symbol, but I don't know what that does for me unless it's these up here at top. Do any of them cost a plant and a beast? I have a beast and two plants. There, right there, that one does. Okay, we're gonna try to buy that here in the next phase, see what happens. We can, okay, so that's what that does. A world tree. Now I have five mana so I can buy again. the good cards though. Life bringer seed that costs five, alright, that sounds like a winner. Planting is again. I'm gonna plant I planted my eagle out there, okay. So he's gonna produce two blue a spoil and a beast. I think. Let's see if our beasts go up one and our spoil, which is a three of three, so that's not good. Right? I think that's bad. I think that means I'm a size spoiled. I made I made this poop the bed right there. Because my dad would say shit the bed. Okay, so I need a card to get rid of spoiled. None out here though, so that's not good. <clears throat> My three blue. So if I replace this, I think it'll get rid of the spoiled. It did not. Put a fertile soil on top of it. Okay. Well, let's see what happens. My spoil was in my turn. I don't know what that means, though. These are my... S oh. Beast Brothers. <clears throat> okay. Still really confused. I don't... <clears throat> Let's see where this card goes. Let's put it out. Okay, just scoops them all down, puts it on the end. Now I have three of three spoiled again. I also have four mana. Let's grab... What? Just buying a little screen. I like that card. Oh, uh, yeah, it didn't have any rot, so I like it. Or we can go to these for the grasslands. Let's do that. I think it goes on top of, like, see how, I think it'll fit right here on top of this card then. Or right there, let's put it there. Yeah, okay, that makes sense now. So you're building <clears throat> the best cards and you can put up to three cards onto a card slot. Okay, I'm getting it figured out slowly. So I spoiled to the end of my turn. All right, so. Play another card. 
one of each phase. I got four mana. So I can put this right there. There you go. And I broke out of mana, so there we go. What's up, bud? Okay. Come on, let's fight. Let's fight. AFK again. So dogs do for you. They make you late for everything. And kids. The day it's the dogs. Okay. So we're getting there slowly. We have six mana this time, which is a ton. I don't think I'm going to plant a card. I'm just going to buy. Because I've seen this Grove Tender. I have my eye on him because he's a bottom card. Ongoing Grove Timber has one force for each helmet on this card. Okay, so here's the bad thing. I don't have any cards with helmets on them. I don't have any blank cards. So let's see if I can replace this with this. It does not let you do that. Okay. So that that kind of sucks. We're going to put it here and then hopefully I can get a top helmet card somewhere. Yes. That's what we're going to do. Okay. Ooh, okay. Alright, alright. I see what's going on here. So I have one beast. I don't know why I don't have a grasslands. That should have... Oh, I do. Why is it over here? Oh, that prevents a spoiled, I think. Okay. I think. So I have one, two, three. Yes, it does. Because I technically have four spoiled out. Okay. That makes more sense. I'm going to plant a card. Oh, it's spoiled. Dang it. All right. Well, that backfired. Three mana. Back and buy another fertile soil. Cancel all but one blank on this card. And that could be good. I see the benefit of it. But let's plant. Four, three, not good. Not into my turn. But I'm gonna buy. Okay, I'm starting to understand now. So if you spoil before you get to your planting phase, you're done. So, okay. So I don't want to plant, I don't think, because I want to harvest. And this will get rid of all but one seedling. Okay. That's perfect. Ooh, that's a nice one. We have six, that's plenty. Let's see if we can buy something big first. I do have a shield, look at that. Oh, yeah, it's, it's on the bottom though. Dang it. Oh, it would fit there, but no. Nah. Okay, I had some blank cards though. Alright, we're gonna put it there. We're gonna put it there and hope that works out. Okay, I got three mana. I think I definitely need to plant a card this time. Okay. Two beasts. I don't think there's any cards of just two beasts that I've seen at least. Yep. Okay. Well, that sucked. Six mana this time. Okay, we're gonna move on. Mindful Owl. When played, you may discard any of the other cards in the field. Oh, that's nice. We can get rid of that. What's Life Bringer do? Cancels all paint, all trees on this card. That could be useful. Is it? Oh, it is top, too. Shoot. I need more cards out here that are bad. Okay, let's put it... Hold on, let's go ahead and buy that. We're going to put it there and then get a medium one that's bad. There we go. 
We're getting this figured out. It's starting to make more sense. I like I, I like it actually now that I kinda know what I'm doing. I understand a lot more. Wow, dude. Oh, nice. It's a good card. So I'm gonna go ahead and grab it. Probably put it right there. Or right there. Let's see wait, what's this card do? Cancels oh, okay. Yeah, we don't want it there then. Let's what's this card do? Well that cancels all too. Well, let's put on the blank card then. Okay, we're gonna need more something. Let's play it. Oh, spoiled. Dang it. That ends my turn right there. Five mana. Gain one TARDIS for each warrior on this card. Uh, it's, it's a bottom card. Think. No, medium card. Okay. I don't have any warrior cards though, so that's kind of useless. I, I can make this a warrior card though. We should have had a little bit more mana. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and do that. Well, I can buy a special card here. I see my other cards. two cards. This dude cancels all but one. That's the card I think that plays off that card, right? Let me make sure. Oh, it doesn't. Man, I'm having a hard time getting a good combo, but I'm going to put it there. got three spoiled. I have three mana. Now we got some big mana. That's helpful. I don't think we need to pull another card here. I think we need maybe this card there. Let's see what this one does. Oh, he produces. It's pretty beastly there. Let's see what's this do. He's a top card. Might be the better move right now.
that produces two TARDISes. Ah, oh, it's the only card I can put it on. That sucks. Ah. Gotta buy a couple cards. I need it, I guess. Let's see. rid of a bad card that might be useful put it on the plow all right let's do that let's do that now we have three by the podlings yeah i don't know Card choices again. I'm gonna plant. Whew! Alright, we got it. We're safe. Now we have four mana, so. Let's just buy that card. Let's do that. Oh, we have some choices up here, too. That's got three TARDISes. That's a no brainer right there. This is with 30. Not bad for not knowing what I'm doing, huh? That was uneasy, though. So. I started to figure it out, though. I, I definitely understand a lot more now. I think I can do a lot better the next next game. So, all right, let's play one more here. Now that we know a lot more of what we're doing, I wonder how it would mix up with with four people. We move four people just up just a couple notches here. Let's see. We'll see. We'll see how we do here. Putting the pressure on. Turns seem to go really fast, so you know you don't have to wait on them, so it shouldn't matter. Okay. Oh, I like my starting hand. Four mana right off the bat. Give me the hawk. All right. Uh, I don't think there's any reading the seed. We'll buy this hawk. Let's see. He's got spoiled though. Let's see. He'd put double spoil on a card, you know. Taking this card. Man, three spoiled already. I can't risk it, so. Cards look kind of not very good. I think I'm just gonna grab a fertile soil and put it on this card, maybe. Call it a turn. Three mana. And I also have three spoiled. We risk it. Nah, let's not risk it. Better to have little than to have none. We are gonna be in the same boat again, I think. Well, slowly but surely, right? We only got two mana this time again. Dang, I'm getting hammered. I thought this was gonna be a good game, but it's not turning out to be that great, but. We'll get there. We're just gonna build up mana slowly. Now we got three. Still not very good. Spoils three at three as well. Still not gonna risk it. There's no fertile land though. Ah, suck. All right, we're gonna we're gonna buy this cleansing rain. Guess I don't know. Doesn't really sound like a useful of a card, but we'll find out.
Now we got five mana, so now we're starting to see things happen here. Cancels all blank on this card. That's nice. One for each helmet. Don't have any helmets out. I don't think I could build a card off this, and we'll start it right here. Okay, that's what we're going to do. Oh, I thought that was the bottom one. Dang it. I only cancel one. That sucks. Dang it, man. All right, well, I'm not going to do that then. There's no empty cards. Guess I could put the wellspring on. Oh, I feel like I got ripped. Now we're back to two mana. Somehow we still have three spoiled because of these cards. <sighs> Frustrating. Nothing to buy for two mana, so I just wasted my turn. I should have planted a card. I didn't look. My own fault. Still three, we got three, nothing to buy, so now we're gonna do it. Here we go. Oh, we spoiled. Dang it. Alright, four mana, here we go. Lots of choices to buy too, which is great. Picking the wellspring might be the way to go. Or the hawk. Go make a complete card there. It's got two spoil on it, which is not good. Yeah, I think we're just gonna go this route. Pretty good draw for the next hand with four mana. We got some empty cards. Yeah, we're gonna rock this. Okay. best card but since we have an empty card we have a place to put it so we're gonna do that all right I have a chance to discard a card I finally drew that I get rid of my cursed land which sounds like a plan to me so we got how do we have all oh, that card spoiled so how do we have three spoiled cards we only have three mana Um, should we risk it? We got a lot of empty cards though. These cards suck. All right, we're gonna risk it. Ah! No luck on the risking so far. Every time we hit, we bust. And we got four mana, so we're gonna rock this one by the grasslands. Guess the one place to put it. Man, the second person is killing everybody. Actually, everybody's killing, killing me now. Everybody else is getting good stuff, and I am not. All right, so it's a top. Of course, it's top. Why would it not be top? Because I need it to be anything but top, and it's top. Dang it! I don't think I can risk not getting it though. Five mana, so that's a nice little start. Don't have any with the fighters on them, do I? Nope. Nope, I got two of those cards sitting there. Three of those cards sitting there. I can make this card into one, I guess. Let's do that. Put it right there. Let's 
Not looking good for us here, I'll tell you that right now. Three mana, no cards. We're gonna go ahead and spoil it. Oh, we didn't. We survived. Thank you, game. We need now six mana. That was a huge draw right there. Talk about needing that. Okay. That's a medium card. Ooh, that dude's awesome. When played, you may discard any of the cards in your field. See, that card's just really good, too, though. You could put it there. I think that's what we want to do. There we go. We needed that turn. I don't know if we'll be able to catch these guys in the middle, but maybe. Three mana, but we also have six buying power this time, so another good hand. Man, I never get my cards with attack on them when I need them. Use the Grove Keeper. I don't have any cards that use a bunch of red right now either. I think we're gonna go with this card. Got red though. Losing our fertile soil. I, I, who cares? Oh, I can discard another one. Oh, I actually don't think I want to get rid of any of these. Wow, eight mana this time. Hell of a round. Oh, there's nothing to cost eight. There's a stag. That looks pretty powerful. Oh, see, I'd love to put a stag right there with that. Is this the bottom card? I think it is. Yeah, of course it is. Oh. Yeah, if I could get a Grove Keeper to the middle like this guy. Right there. Bam. Okay. Oh, that dude's about to win. Is there a way for me to attack him? I don't think there is. Okay. I only got four mana this time. We got a rocket. Oh, we only got two mana. Even worse. Ah, right, we spoiled. Didn't need that at all. I'm much better with six mana this time. I don't think it's that good now. I think the bear might be better. I think I get 37. Wow, did you see him jump? Yeah. Yeah, I deserved to be in last. That was terrible. Wow, I didn't think it would be that hard raising the difficulty just a little bit. I wonder if this is a four player part. That I'm not sure about. We're gonna do one more game. Because I actually had a lot of fun there. We're gonna do four players in easy difficulty this time and see where it gets us. Build of flowers right there.
I'm gonna leave those, I'm gonna try to discard them. If I get a discard one. Holy smokes, seven mana. Oh, because I got the three right there. Four, five, six, and seven. Nice. Thinking Mindful Isles coming out. I'm going to put plow on that one, or this one. Nowhere for the ch you need any of these cards to go. Cleansing Rain might be a good purchase. Put it on there, maybe. What that card said. Yeah, I think that's a good move. We have three more mana. There's nothing to buy, so that was a waste, I guess. I don't know. Maybe it wasn't a good move. Pretty strong card. Yeah, I only have two mana, so I'm gonna definitely place another card. Now I have three mana I didn't spoil. Still didn't spoil, now I have four mana. So that's what I wanted, that was good drawing right there. Wayfarer's in the middle. I think that's a good move. I have four bad ones on this, but this cancels it. So I have three right now. I only have four mana, but that's still enough to buy a card, so we're gonna rock forward. I like this eagle a lot. I wish I had a better card to put him on. We'll start there. Oh, no one discard either one of those. They're both good cards. Now we got eight mana coming up, which is awesome. Really, really, really tempted. 
So I now just, I just understood something. I didn't quite understand how it was working before. So you draw cards until you get three um, spoiled. So that's why I have so many cards this turn, because I didn't draw three spoiled until right there. So that makes a lot of sense. I didn't, I didn't understand that at first. So does that create a spoiled? I think it does. But it also creates two shields. And a, a star, which I think... I don't know. I don't know. It doesn't really seem worth it, does it? I'm really tempted to draw another card. But man, if I spoil out an eight mana... Nah, I'm not going to do that. That's too terrible. Alright, so this cancels all on that card. Let's see if there's a three to buy. No, nope, there's a four though. Shoot. Wow, this is tough. Plow works good. I don't know. Maybe just do that. I hate not being able to buy the, the hive though. Maybe get one that says cancels all but one on this card right here. That might work. Let's do that. Yes, I do want to discord, discard the heart, the cursed lands. Thank you. Seven mana. Nice, nice, nice. This cancels all but one. There's no bottom tiers though. That sucks. Oh. That's a nice card. I can buy that and then that'd be it. Oh, I can't buy this. I don't think there's any reason not to buy this card, to be honest. Let's see what this card says again. It doesn't say anything, but it'd be really good to have one that cancels all but one on there. Of course, I build a bunch of these cards and I don't get the one that cancels all, it's gonna kill me, so we'll see. Fan of this one. I, could, I guess we're gonna build a card. Terrible draw. Two mana. Yeah, we're, we're gonna draw another card. That gives us three mana. Still can't buy anything. There, we spoiled. Oh man, that was a good, terrible card to spoil on, too. Shoot. Wait, what? I spoiled on my planting phase? I didn't know that was possible. I just lost two turns in a row. That's not good at all. Mm, I don't think this card name does. Good cards. That one I do. Oh my goodness, 14 mana. Wow. Wow, okay. Let's see what we got here. Oh. That's kind of cool. Okay. 
I don't have anywhere to put that. It's a medium. Ooh. That's pretty good. That's really good, actually. It does have a tree on it, though, so that sucks. Hold on. And then that cancels all the one tree. It's not. It's its top. Dang. That's tempting. It only costs seven, though. Well, I got 14 mana, though. That might be the way to do it. Put that there and then buy a Grove Keeper or a bear. I can't buy the bear for some reason. I wonder why that is. Oh, no middle slots of it. So that cancels a negative. That cancels a negative. I'm thinking right here. And then we'll put a guy with attack on top of there, hopefully. We're getting there. No! Oh, no! I was not ready to end the game. I ended it quick. Well, so definitely more players the harder the game is. I was definitely more with him that game, though, but... Alright, everybody, I'm going to end the stream there again. This game is called Mystic Veil. It's available on Steam. Was it $15 or $10? Let me look. I forget how much it was. You can pick it up for $10, even better. Uh, it just came out uh, a couple days ago, November 27th. Uh, it's pretty cool. I like it. Now I know what I'm doing. They definitely need to work a little bit more on the tutorial, but, you know, it's a newer game, and uh, it's an indie team that did it, so Nomad Games is the uh, developer and publisher. So Well done, though. It's really fun once you learn how to play. I like it a lot. So uh, I'm excited to play multiplayer, too. I think it would be a lot of fun. So Thanks for watching, everybody. Hit that follow and like button. Help me grow my community. Have a great evening.